Hello, Dr. Joe here. So, in today's video, we're going to be looking at what vitamin D is doing at the level of your cells. Now, to illustrate this, I'm wearing this shoelace on my neck here. And uh, in your cells, you've got chromosomes, of course. And your chromosomes have got two strands, just like this shoelace. And at the end of each strand, you've got this structure, like this very shoelace here. You got a structure at the end of each strand and it is called telomere okay the structure is called telomere now what you want to do in your life and in your lifestyle is to preserve the length of this very telomere because the shorter it is the more you are susceptible to age related diseases like cardiovascular disease like cancer and even premature death so you want to preserve the length of this telomere as much as possible. So the question is this, what does vitamin D do to the telomeres? Does it hasten the shortening of the telomeres or does it slow it down? So we're going to be looking at that through the lens of a study shortly. But before we do a quick plug, what you're seeing on your screen now is my book on managing high blood pressure with lifestyle approach. This is the second edition of this very book. Links to get the book right below this very video. Now let's jump right in. Oh yes, the goal of this very research was to answer this very question. Is vitamin D protective of telomeres? And uh, this very research was uh, published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition. And it had the title, Vitamin D3 and omega-3 fatty acid supplementation, and leukocyte telomere length, four-year findings from the vitamin D and omega-3 trial, vital, uh, randomized control trial. So how did the study authors go about the study? Well, they recruited 2,571 study participants, and they gave them 2,000 international units of vitamin D per day, okay? That's how much vitamin D uh, they gave to the study participants. And uh, the two genders were involved in the study. The males were 50 years and over, and the females were 55 years and over. And uh, it was a placebo-controlled trial. And uh, the other thing they did, and this is the main thing actually, uh, the study authors measured the telomere length at baseline, okay? Uh, in year two and year four. So telomere length was measured at baseline years two and four. Now, let's look at their finding. So the main finding was that vitamin D preserved telomere length by 0 0.035 kilobase pairs per year of follow-up. That's in comparison to placebo. Now, this 0 0.035 kilobase pairs might not sound like a lot, but it is huge, okay? It is huge, and it is something to be appreciated. Now, in total, over the four-year period, vitamin D3 supplementation significantly decreased the leukocyte telomere length attrition by 0 0.14 kilobase pairs over the four years. Uh, this is in comparison to placebo. So biologically speaking, uh, this preservation is really, really significant. And that's the reason they use the word significant there. So uh, this is not to be sniffed at at all. Now, the other thing to note is that uh, omega-3 supplementation was also a part of the study. So did the omega-3 do anything to preserve uh, telomere length? Well, no, it didn't. Omega-3 supplementation did nothing to preserve the telomeres nothing at all. So vitamin D is what you need to preserve your telomere length. Now, uh, have you subscribed to my newsletter yet? It's over there on Substack. All you need to do is type askdoctjoe.org and uh, you will be redirected to that very page and uh, you just subscribe. So this um, finding from this very study is a relatively new benefit discovery for vitamin D. And as far as I'm concerned, it is just one more reason for you to take your vitamin D, okay? Uh, take it either daily or weekly. 
and uh, you will be good to go. So uh, let's make sure we're taking our vitamin D, even during the summer months, okay, based on the other video that I did uh, a couple of weeks ago. So hopefully you got some value from this very video. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up. Please like the video and also please share this video with your friends, family and colleagues. They need to know about telomeres, okay? Something new for them to uh, learn about. Um, questions, comments down below. That's it for this video. Until next time. Well, this is Dr. Joe signing out.